Hey folks, 13 here. This is Action Soup Studios coverage of Adventure Zader, When Pigs Fly. We have been really about covering early access games on Steam, and when we saw this in the pre-early access section, we were stoked. We reached out and the developer reached back and handshaking occurred. And here we are doing coverage. And this is an awesome title. I am so stoked. As a gamer, as a player of uh, adventure games and RPG type games, um, having that connection to your character, I see a lot of really great potential in the main storyline. And absolutely loving the concept of the sandbox i only get to stick my little toe into it in this episode and it's love at first sight i so mourn the fact that i have a ton of work to do in my day job this weekend i love my day job and i'm happy to have all that work but it's a lot of work that i have to do for them this weekend so uh, i'm not going to be able to put out as many episodes or put the kind of focus into YouTube this weekend that I usually do, and if I could, we would be doing a stream right now. I would be drinking big pots of coffee, and at like four o'clock in the morning, we might, we might have, we might be done. But uh, I could build buildings for quite a while. Just looking at the editor really made lots of sense and uh there were other tools that looked like they'd be a lot of fun to get into if i guess <clears throat> excuse me in the voice break have i gushed enough should we just say comment like subscribe participate always remember to share and enjoy maybe there we go okay my mic's plugged in all the way so never mind okay all right so we're doing it. All right. Um, I have been looking forward to this title. I'm so excited. Shh. Watch. Watch. It's cool. I feel like I'm looking off screen. Look at that. Am I looking off screen? Mm -mm. Are you sure? Look at, a, look at the camera. Is that off screen? Over to there? Yeah, yeah, it is. That's where I'm looking. But I'm looking in the same direction, so... Hey, Pinky, what do you want to do tonight? I'm going to adjust that. Same thing we tried to do every night, Granny. Take on the world! All right, now we're looking down Starting at the take game. Shape, but that last scene needs more impact. Let's set a huge font and make it pink. Lightning! Add a lightning strike. Take on the world! All right, we're making games, people. Huh? All right, we're making games, people. Oh, who's changing my fonts? I am changing your fonts. No, I'm not that dude. I'm that dude. Cthulhu. You're not Cthulhu. Cthulhu uses this project. You know, I just want to say that I need a... Oh. Adventure, oh, Adventure Zader, Adventure Zader, when, when pigs fly. Oh man, if we've been so looking forward to this title. Let's see. So, with this is pre early access, folks. You're getting the sneakest of peaks. This is uh, Alpha. It's, we're very excited about it. Gamer Snack brought to you by Stacks. Lace no, 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 no. Are you? No, no, no. Good, 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 good. I don't know if I endorse that. Let's see. What do we got here? We got Lay's stacks, bacon and cheddar potato skins. Let's see. Let's see if this is the official game. I don't, we usually don't product what we're eating. We usually just. No, totally. I've never. Okay, the donuts. And the Cheetos. Okay. And the nuts. Oh. I use that part of my brain that 
their taste, absorb the texture. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. I'll buy it. Well, apparently I did. Press F1 for help notes. Click anywhere to dismiss. So, folks, we wanted to do this first episode. Those things really stay with you. We wanted to do this first episode, and uh, we're going to go straight for the, the quickie. We're going to... It's got a swirling vortex, and... Yeah, I'm drawn. No quickie for me? There's a quickie? So... Okay, welcome. We are okay. told that go... By the way, the dev told us that it went from welcome. Hmm? The dev told us that the levels go from welcome, angry bears, and Newton balls. Yes, yes, and that uh, Newton balls is in the best shape right now. This game is in development. We uh, want to stress that we're getting an early peak, and that's a privilege. So let's be uh, cool about our uh, privileged privilosity here. Let's see, select that. Okay. Ow! Used to lead a normal oh, life I mean, uh... I said A.O. Traveling oh. <laughs> the world, selling his own self-made magic <coughs> potions that were not very magic, but not very potion -y at all. They were really just colored bottles of muddy water. Oh. One day, in one of his shortcuts to avoid meeting his old, not so happy when finding out about his fake magic potions customers, he accidentally bumped into an old-looking man. He's a wizard. For Edmund's misfortune, they sell muddy water at the uh, customers, but also a local Whole wizard. Foods place. In the midst of all the shouting and cursing, mostly about a bad night at the latrine, a mm. curse was cast upon Edmund. A pig man he would become. And just like that, Edmund's quest to become a man again began. There are uh, certain benefits to being a pig. What the hell just happened? You have an excuse oh, for being messy? My pants are ruined. Uh, you make your own bacon. Okay, so... What? ASDF... Okay, so folks, the game got its disclaimer. Now I get mine. Uh, today was... Uh, it's Friday night, and today was a really long day, and there's a whole weekend of overtime coming. And in the midst of that, in a 13-hour Friday, I am sitting down to this game. That's how excited we are about this title. So, uh, watch, keep your eye out for the game, be ready to pounce on it when it hits early access. Ah, so, ASDF gives me camera control, and then I got point and click interface. Uh, let's see, let's open this thing. Um, sword? What is this? Oh, what that was? A clock part. A clock part. You may very well be. Sm oh wait, can I use? It was a lock pick. I bet. What? Wait, hold on. I'm an idiot. Give it back. Now what can I do? Check out. Oh, what? I checked out. I didn't want to check out. Oh, wait. Hold on. I can also look in this. Cool. I will... Oh, wait. Hold on. I want to look at it. Wait. And I want to pick it up. Cool. That's quite the pig butt. Yeah, hey, baby. 
what's, what's this about? Oh, wait, hold on. Hold everything. Uh, hold on, I may, I may know what to, oh. Uh, how do I zoom in and out? Scroll wheel on the mouse. Well done, developers. I love it when the camera uh, height is controlled by the scroll wheel. That's happy, happy news. Okay, let's go look at this again. It, it doesn't seem to be lockable. I, I don't know why I'm failing with the... It, it is locked. Check the flower. Check the flower. What? There's a... No? No? Yes? All I can do is look at it. It's very cute. Okay. Uh, is there stuff on the ground right there? I feel bad. I'm making the game look bad because I'm just... Oh, Shady Elf. Shady Gnome, I think. Shady Gnome. Scroll down. Go down. What? What? Hook? Hook? Oh. Oh. Hey. Hey, Garden Gnome. No, I, I can't go check him out. Oh, did my pig take off all the way over there? Maybe I have to stand near it and look at the lock pick. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I'm remembering how to do things. Use lock pick with gate. Hey, hey, hey. Or you can totally ignore that gnome that's by himself. I went over to the gnome. This gnome does something. He's got a name. It's empty. Uh, let's take that. Do we walk around with it? Oh, 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 we don't. Hey, whoa. Okay, so. The lamp was keeping him. Hold on, dude. Hello, Mr. Pig. I saw what happened to you. Holy crap. I thought you were one of those garden gnomes. No, 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 no. Well, technically I am, but so are all gnomes now. We gnomes have been cursed as well. The whole species. Whenever there is light around, we turn into stone. That's a long story. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, but right now I have my own problems to deal with. Well, ain't that a happy coincidence? We can both help each other. Right now, all you need to know is that I have the recipe for a potion of uncurse. I need your help to get the ingredients. You need my help to know how to get them. We should get moving before the sun rises. Alrighty. Um, wait. Can I talk to all your buddies here? Did your buddies talk? No, all I can do is look at them. Uh, can I go in the house? Anything? Nope. Can't do it. There's nothing in the house I need. Pumpkin field? No. No. Okay. I accept that. I'm cool. Maybe now we can talk to the green gnome. Oh, 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 oh. Yep, I'm trying to get there. I'm being dumb. I'm <laughs> being tired. Ooh. Okay, okay, here we go. Nah, no. he's just... He's just back there. I really want him to be doing something conspirit conspiratorial uh, conspiratorial conspiratorial. Was I supposed to follow the gnome? Did he go this way? What happened? Oh, found him. He's right there by your wagon. Oh yeah. Okay. Hey, buddy. I turned the light off for you. It's daytime. Oh no, dude. Dude, uh, get in your coffin. Oh, you can put them away. Oh, you can open them. I can open them? Yes. That's very personal. Uh, all right. Man, that's, uh, 
That's messed up. Okay, well, I feel like I'm supposed to be doing something with... Wait, it says what we're supposed to be doing. You can't see it because the uh, microphone boom is in the way. And I can't see it because I'm tired. First step. So Edmund must um, talk to Zoo Inkle. I Edmund can see must that. read a note. He must pick up a note. Zoo Winkle must survive. Okay, so... I don't know where he went. There he is. Okay, so... He's not talkable now. It's daytime. He's all, uh... Okay, we gotta find a note. Oh, there's a note! Let's read a note. Okay. <clears throat> hey, Zook. Great news. We finally did it. We found a way to get rid of this damn curse and get back to normal. Well, at least we think we did. Oh, it's not, it's not. oh I'm too tired. I failed. Um, I'm going to stop griping about being too tired right now. Out. Our gnomes? Our gnome elders. Our gnome elders found a very old recipe of what looks like an uncursed potion. And even though we're not usually not usually right. They oh, are not. I, okay, they're not usually right. I think it's worth a shot to try and get the ingredients to craft that potion. Um tired of being confused with a garden gnome. Here are the ingredients. Burfur. Bear Bear fur. Burfur. Bear fur. Burfur? <laughs> to do, to do. Hmm. Alright, well. Let's put it that way. Let's put that away. I don't know if uh, the to do, to do is a joke or if that is part of the uh, in development ness of the project. So, it's daytime now and the. Edmund must... Oh, I, I, gotta, I gotta get the note. It's my note now. Um, I guess Zoo Inkle did survive. I didn't uh, kill him. When sleeping, actors slowly recover their health. Hmm. Oh yeah, eating too. Alright. So... I'm excited to see what we get uh, get to do here. I'm also excited to play in the sandbox. We can make our own RPGs. And we're going to do something so fun, folks. We're going to do Mad Lib Adventure Zader when pigs fly. So this is the way this will work. Uh, we'll come up with a list of uh, nouns and verbs and whatnot that we'll have pre-numerically assigned to some of the aspects of the game that we're going to develop or that we have developed or whatever uh, that we're going to develop. That's right. It's going to be a week out project uh, process the first time and we'll try to trim that back to three days as we get better at doing what we do in the sandbox to make the uh, games or levels so we'll come up with this numeric formula we'll uh, post it as a comment in the bottom of the video and you fill in those attributes with verb noun adverb whatever we're asking for <clears throat> and then we'll uh, pour them into our development and it will affect the course of the development and the overall storyline based on a masterful uh, mathematic chaos theoretic discrete we're just gonna kind of wing it right we're gonna wing it uh oh it looks like uh, we may have encountered an in development moment so we will go right on to uh, back to level select and we'll be right back all right folks here we are we're uh, coming back into the game I wanted to come in early because I didn't feel like you uh, ow! I didn't feel like you got to see enough of that um, 
enough of the company logo. I think it's awesome. Okay, I it's very all oh, that's very cool, but all right. It's time to play the game, man. I love that. Is you Oh, that was such a cool experience. So as you click through that, instead of just cutting right through the cutscene, it moves to the next scene as you click. So you're so powerful! That was fun. That was actually really cool. Are you jealous that you don't get to play the first time here? You get the first of the uh, next title we support. I promise. Not that one. Angry Bears. I thought Angry Bears was, uh, really? Is that what we wanted to do? I thought we wanted to do this one and, and not this one. We're going to do them all. Some of them were supposed to be rough. I don't know why we wouldn't. The developer was really open about saying um, <clears throat> that there's some rough stuff. And we want to see what there is, right? We do want to see what there is. And... You guys know that this is in development, so nobody's going to hold anybody for any kind of ransom or anything. Let's go explore. This is fun stuff. Cthulhu! Barely He's so cute! With their much needed claws, Edmund and Zook wander the forest, thinking about their next move. We were lucky mm. to have that blonde girl arrive. Cthulhu texting. She seemed to be their friend. Yep, it looked like they were having fun. All right. Jeez, man. Upon entering a clearing in the forest, they spot a man wearing a strange wig near some apple trees. He knows no nothing of gravity. Right. The unusual pair stops to talk to him. When pigs fly, Newton's balls. Oh, man. All right. Nice. Looks like he's an alchemist. Let's talk to him, Zook. Just do it fast. It's almost on. Um. Okay. So, first of all, mind if I... I should talk to him before I shut the light. Hold on. Can I pickpocket him? Is that how that works? Okay, well, let's sit down next to him. Okay, buddy. Why uh, you got kidnapped and didn't notice that you got something on your face there? How's it going? Oh, Hi, I want to sit next to him and talk. You? I'm Newton, Sir Isaac Newton. What can I do for you, Edmund? But remember that to every action, there must be always an equal and opposite reaction. So, I'll help you if you help me first. Oh, Why yes. should I trust you? Oh, I never yes. said that you should. It's your choice. Well, what is it you want? I've been doing some advanced alchemy research. You'll find my notes and my recipes inside my cabin. For my next trick, I'm turning water into wine. Find my wine recipe and brew one for me, would you? <laughs> but isn't your door locked? You're not even worthy <laughs> of talking to me if you can't get past the door. Off you go. I'm thirsty. All right. Well, I'm also going to be shutting your lights off. Actually, I want to take your light. Give me your light. Are you going to hate me if I take your light? I'm going to turn off all your lights. It looks like it's daylight anyway, right? Yep. Yep. I can't do anything with him anyway. So we need to... Uh, Edmund must... Craft an old wine. Interesting. Edmund must pass through the rainforest door. Okay, so... Oh, look, another... Um, gnome that doesn't look like a generic one. Turn off alchemy table. I don't want to turn it off. Oh, look. Move, scroll up. Move up, I mean. Oh, to what? Oh, that another gnome? It's named it Ankle is, but Ankle Biter. It is named, and I'm going to see if he has anything in him. Uh, it's empty, and he's angry. He don't like it. 
Whoa. Ankle biter did it. Ankle biter did it. I. Th Whoa. Wait, hold on. Okay, so that appears to be in development, but I gotta say. Basically, I went over to Cavity Search a Gnome, and Isaac Newton got his leg bit off, and it was me. So, that's a great moment in gaming. My goodness. I, I know it probably isn't going to be like that. Maybe it is. Maybe I missed some dynamic story thing there. But uh, if it's not like that when the game gets released, I feel so awesome for getting to experience Isaac Newton's death that way. Um, that's mean to say. It's much more interesting than the way that Isaac Newton actually died. Okay, so as I recall, this might be the glitchy level. As he re while trying to leave, the those look like weeping angels. Yeah. A house of bears. Fortunately for them, Cherry Pie would love it. Claws for Zuckwinkle's potion. Unfortunately for them. Bears really like bears. Man, too bad she wasn't playing with us. She would have just freaked out. As I recall, this is broken, but... As you recall, it's the best level yet, right? Claw thingy here. Mm. I see. This is a really bad idea. I can't read that text on my screen. Might as well find something to eat while I'm at it. I should probably wait until they're asleep. Or I could be the thing on the menu tonight. I must consume a fish. I hope that it's uh, a cod or maybe a tilapia. Not a fishy fish. In my experience, the bonier the fish, the more fishy the fish is, right? Yeah. Yep. What about you folks? Comment on the uh, properties of fish. Yeah, so the Mad Lib thing that I was rambling on about. We'll get that set up. I think I'm missing the whole point here. We'll get the Mad Lib thing set up as quickly as we can. The, um, this weekend is insane for me. I'm afraid you guys are going to get... Uh, I wanted to start streaming and stuff this weekend, but I think I have a ton of work to do. I think I have, you know, like 20 hours of work to do. Oh, whoa! So, there's, there's social... Stop, dude! Stop biting me! Stop kicking my butt! I don't walk into the bear's house. So, eater of all the gaming snacks, how's it feel to be the eater of all the gaming snacks? Pre-filling. This is why you're not allowed to sit down with a box or something. Well, first off, this is mine. Uh-oh, 34% is a, a familiar number. So, we're going to come back to level select. Actually, uh, we'll come back to level select and see... What we can see. I think the problem is that we keep getting killed. And it's surely your fault. But. Hey folks. Alright, here we are. We'll, we will uh, try. Now that I have an understanding of what may be happening there. Basically, we're failing. We'll go back in. We will not cavity search the gnome this time. I really want to do the sandbox. Oh my goodness. We're 29 minutes into the episode. Well, that's what a good game does. It makes you lose track, right? Oh. We're going to do an hour-long episode. Somewhere between a half an hour After and an hour. Barely escaping the bears with their much needed claws. Edmund and Zook wander the forest. Oh, so they this is level game. 3. We were lucky to have that blonde This is the good one. She seemed to be their friend. Yep, it looked like they were having fun. 
Upon entering a clearing in the forest. Okay. We'll, we'll go right back into Newton's balls. Okay. Nice. Looks like he's an alchemist. Let's talk to him, Zook. Alchemist. Just do it fast. It's almost on. Uh, Beat him up. No, no. Hi there. I'm that Edward. does not pay. You? So you don't want to eat, no, eat another sir, leg? Isaac knew. What can I do for you, Good. Edmund? But remember that to every action... There must be always an equal in So I remember reaction. what the uh, so, face thing is about. You if you help me first. And now if I'm wrong, you. sorry to the I developer. So sorry, but uh, I think I'm right. Well, when you, you do the development You'll find my notes sandbox my part of the game, I believe you can use trick, a face I'm cam to... Uh, or find maybe just Im uh, image files for me, would you? to uh, get the face, so you can make custom want? faces. You're not even worthy of talking to me. So and we will do an RPG with all of us. Action RPG. Bastard, I'm the thirsty. studio dog, Action Bastard, will definitely be in there. I'm sure all the studio dogs will be, actually. Okay, so we're supposed to make a wine. Uh, this says turn off. Okay, let's turn it back on then. I wasn't paying any attention to what he said. <laughs> I was busy talking over him. We have to get inside his house. Okay. How I thought I had to make a fine wine. That's where the recipe is. Well, let's open those. Wait, what? What's going on? I didn't do it! Run! Can I run this time? Oh, for, so for some odd reason, Isaac Newton just beats you up for no reason. Wow. Time to eat another leg! <clears throat> okay. Well. Well. <laughs> I am really curious about Sandbox. I'm really curious about more level stuff, but... Oh, folks. It's like, uh... Let's just give this game a, the whole feature. Yeah, it's so, it's, it's, it's so much we're not going to get it in one show. I want to take a peek at Sandbox. Don't obligate me to do anything amazing in Sandbox, but I definitely want to take a peek. Okay, levels, cutscenes, actors... Let's see if we can get a quick overview of each one of these. Okay, so you can set up a cutscene. See, yep, there's uh, music. Click these toggle panels. Okay, play cutscene. Click start page. Okay. All right, so this is going to be something like an animation studio. There's a timeline down at the bottom, right? And uh, we have some graphical control and some auditory control of what's going on. And that's mucho awesome. We're going to have to do this game as a stream, don't you think? Yeah. I think to really do it justice, it's going to need to be a stream. And then we'll uh, cut highlights out of the stream. You can do that on YouTube, apparently. And I'm going to figure that out. For you folks, not this weekend, though but as soon as possible. Okay, so I want to go. Nope. <laughs> Let's see. Do you see the go anywhere? Do you see the we're done? Escape? Escape. Okay, so Actua. Oh, that's literally the main menu. Had to be tried. So we have campaigns. Uh levels okay so this is like a 3d editor uh, a placer of things I gotta play with this a little bit I really uh, I really love this type of stuff okay so let's nice 
most excellent. <laughs> and then we'll do that again from like here out, right? <laughs> sure. Sure, sure. Sure, sure, sure. Grab a little stone here. Oh, yeah. That, that's good stuff. That's good stuff. I like it. I like it. I wonder how big a door is. I want to set the door off center. So you, I right, right clicked to end that operation. You know what I think I'm going to do? I'm going to put the controls on screen for you folks as I'm doing stuff. Let's just stop there and get the door. A stone door, if you will. Uh, right there. How, how do we do it? How do you do the door? Do you put it in the wall? I think you put it in the wall. Okay. Hold on. Oh, we're going to build so many awesomenesses. Hold on. Yep. Yeah. Okay. See what I did there? Yep. 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 We're already cooking with magic. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. I, I, I don't know why you don't like it. Okay. Is it because I put it in the wall? I have to put it in the wall. It's the only place it wants to be. Maybe it's those... Oh, I know what happened. Double wall. Yes. Let's. So let's do that same effect a different way, right? Okay. Let me think about it. I know how to do it. Okay. I'll leave that door there. We'll have a back door. In reality, he doesn't. Oh, I could get sucked into this. I could totally get sucked into this. Let's see. Let's go from here to here. And then to there. And then we'll do it again. Oh, no. We'll do this again. From here to here. Okay. And then we place the door. Right there. And then just to see what it looks like. Um, Wait, hold on. Can I go a, a level up? Is that an option? Just one story buildings? All right, all right. I can I can live. I can live. Two stories would be pretty awesome, but I can I can do this. I can still be pretty cool with one story. It's, it's all right. Uh, it doesn't like that wall. There isn't enough wall. Okay, that's a thing to to be rememberating. Oh, oh, it likes that. Ah. Likes that. Pigger, pigger, pigger. I wonder how I flip it. Pigger. Scroll wheel. Right trigger. Nope. All right. <clears throat> okay, folks. I could get sucked in. Hold well, on, we never checked the last editor. Oh, you're right. So, escape. I'm trying. Actor editor. Okay. Ah, uh, yep. Yeah, see? Mask editor. So I wonder if there's a number of different masks. So those are the different actors. There's the mouth thing. Can I wonder if you can load in? Uh. Wait, hold on. What? Uh, uh, it, there's a use mask. Okay. Where? What? At, Edit. Hold on. At the bottom right. I mean left. Remove mask. Use mask. Talk test. There's stuff. There's stuff, stuff that we'll st no, 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 we'll no, click no. buttons in the next episode. There's all kinds of awesome stuff that can happen here. Apparently, I'm not using things right. I'm not using anything right. It's because you're still in the mask editor tab. Uh, you have to either do the remove it. Oh, or... I see. I see. You're trying to save me from myself. There's nothing happening. And use it. I tried to do it all. Well, I have nothing. Ah, uh, me either. Me either, but 
I am super tired. Oh, I think we may have... Nope. I'm super tired, and we're going to have to end the episode here. Oh, folks. The title looks great, and we can't wait to get into it. The Mad Lib... Uh, the Mad Lib thing, we'll get that together. And uh, not in this episode will we post that, but we'll do a Mad Lib episode, and we'll let you know, uh, actually, I guess in the stream, the stream is going to be all about us learning how to do this game, right? So, in the stream, <clears throat> we'll uh, provide information down at the bottom about the uh, Mad Lib stuff. So once we have a good idea of what we're working with, and what makes sense to do is kind of our Mad Lib approach to building levels. But we can't wait to involve you guys and to see how you participate and what kind of crazy stuff we can do together. Hey folks, what do you think? Isn't it beautiful? Oh man, it's lovely. I can't wait. I can't wait. The concept of the Mad Lib contest that we're going to do and the participation that it will allow us to have with you and uh, the interaction with the game. It's just all very lovely. I'm going to miss stuff. Bet you can't wait to get your hands on it. Maybe. Maybe not. He didn't. You didn't grow up with Mad Libs like I do, did. Do you know the concept of a Mad Lib? Yeah, I've done them. Okay, so did you do them right? In other words, would you have gotten in trouble if we had read your Mad Libs yes. as parents? Okay, Maybe so... Maybe a little bit worried. So... I was bored. Okay. Um, I'm going to pretend I didn't hear that uh, until after the episode, and then we'll have a talk with a counselor. Anyway, um... So we're stoked about that. Uh, when you guys think up your nouns, verbs, adverbs, of course we're going to ask you not to use profanity. But if you're smart and creative, and we see that you're being smart and creative, we'll use your selections. We already know that we're going to have, like, uh, you know, a pile of responses. We'll take those responses, those 10 words or whatever, and in the number one position from everybody's number one position word, we'll pick the best word. So nobody, it's going to be a community effort thing, and we're going to direct it a little bit, and we have great hopes for the RPG and uh, scenes. We can do cut scenes, and a lot of these Mad Libs are going to come right into the cut scenes. It's going to be so awesome. All right, folks, we can't wait. We can't wait. You're going to be seeing a lot of this title, and you're going to uh, be seeing a lot of this Mad Lib contest. And remember, the more people we have actually participating, the better the Mad Lib contest is going to be. If nobody sub sub uh, sub sub support, sub 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 if no one submits any words, then our cutscenes are going to be like, and she blanked, and that'd be funny for the first 35 blanks, according to my research, just pulled out of the air, which most of my research is, then snatched out of the air. The air is a good, there's research everywhere if you know where to look for it. So uh, anyway, folks, comment, like, subscribe, participate, always remember to share, and we will definitely see you next time for this title. Boop. Goodbye. You'd think he's the tired one. <laughs> I thought you were... I was waiting for you, for you to say goodbye like you usually do. Do I say goodbye? Yeah. I'm sorry, folks. I'm tired. Or goodbye. Say, or you say see you later. I don't say see goodbye. See you next time. I said see you next time. No, I you told said... them elaborately that they would see us next time. <laughs> no, you said, and we'll see you. It's all going into the blooper reels. Into the blooper reel. Boop. <laughs>